This is Rick Reiner, manager of Web Analytics with Alight Analytics, and I'm going to show you Google Analytics' new Add Segment feature. So as many of you probably know, you can add a segment to your data, which helps you slice it into smaller chunks when you're trying to do analysis. You start that by clicking the Add Segment button. Once you've clicked this, the first thing you'll notice is that Google has a bunch of system segments already built out for you. I'm going to show you how to build a new custom segment. Start that by clicking on the red New Segment button. And once you do that, the most flexible way to build your segment and powerful is use the conditions feature down below. And I'm going to build out a segment today to look at how many people from the city of Kansas City visited our website. So I'll start by selecting city from the first drop down list. And I will do contains Kansas City. And as you'll notice, it starts to autofill for me, and so I can select that. Um, in the past, to see what data that I would have then, I would have to click the preview button and look at the reports. What Google has added is a summary box to the right that shows me automatically that 7.79% of my users um, were from Kansas City. It also tells me that was 264 sessions. What if I also want to say how many people were from Kansas City or Overland Park, Kansas? Click on the OR button and then select Overland Park in the box here. As you'll notice, the instant I click out of that, it updates the summary on the right to let me know that 11.68% of my users are now included in this segment that I've built. So I'm happy with my segment now, so I give it a nice name, like users from KC and OP. Click the Save button, and that segment is now saved in my custom segments and is applied to the data I'm looking at. So that is Google's new updated Add a Segment feature.